Hello and you're be watching now, later on YouTube, Leading here along with... Rakir! And welcome to Orcs Must Die 2, which we'll be playing in, well, <laughs> well with, with two players. Uh, yeah. Nothing too much different here. It, there's no pre-cutscene uh, with this, or at least not before the menu. So let's move into here, create party, and then let's see you on, on the list here. There you are. Really should add a profile pic at some point. <laughs> I've been thinking of one, but yeah, a bit on what, uh, how I do it and all that. It should be among the settings. Uh, we can we can bleh. we can take a look at that after the stream and after our break. But yeah, yeah. <clears throat> there you go. Okay. Oh, uh, I really hope I won't be echoing today. Uh, yeah, he still needs to find a good, uh, decent pair of earplugs because otherwise, uh, a lot of echo. And okay, I think I need to turn off vo in game voice chat again because I deleted the test character. Uh, yeah. In this game, you get to choose, like, of course, it's the sequel to Orcs Must Die 1, which we played earlier. And this time, you can choose between the War Mage or the Sorceress. And well, <laughs> Drakir called uh, dibs like the day that we finished Orcs Must Die 1. Yep, and uh, wait for me. Hmm? Yes. Uh, yeah, he has done a bit of extra work uh, to test out the game. We did a short recording to see how the game audio and such uh, were. And uh, yeah, we have the story mode here, Endless Classic and a bunch of others. Most of these need to be bought as DLC, but we're only here for the story, really. So we're going for the edge as on the War Mage difficulty. Yep, and I have ma made a second character of this version of the Sorceress. However, this one I made today and only grinded her for the outfit. So I should still be on par in skills with the Hillian. Yeah. Okay, your turn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I just noticed that. <laughs> uh, yeah, this I like that they added this in to just yeah give a basics give the basics to anyone who hasn't played like the original or any of these tower defense ish games before. We have the objective, currency, risk points, which is basically our health, the wave counter, and our loadout in the middle. Was this how it would end? Trapped. Surrounded. My power lost. I deserved so much more. They were coming for me. Once I was their queen, now they would be my doom. Then, out of nowhere... New Rift? It was different. Fragile. I felt a trickle of power returning. Barely there. Not enough to mind control even a single orc. Still. 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 The rift offered an escape. As soon as I stepped through, I saw... him. Standing right in front of me with that ridiculous grin plastered across his face. I only had one thing to say. RUN! Was it you? Was what me? The rift! Can't you feel the magic returning? Did you open it? Nah, I'm more of a closer. Hey, aren't you that crazy lady that tried to kill me? There's no time! The orcs are right behind me! Orcs? Nice! Now you're talking my... talkie language thing. Space of network trouble, please wait or disconnect. Uh, I had to right, take. Um... Okay. Uh, yeah, Drakir was still getting. E was still echoing everything, so I just upped the game volume and, well, alerted him to that. So, All yeah, right. things may have stuttered there for a bit. Right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, as I said, it's in the volume I did uh, 
before the game only affects the matches. Since it did not affect the cutscene at all. Yeah. But do I still echo now? No, no, it, it's the it's the characters talking. I think it might also have to do with the push to, with the in-game microphone, which is set to uh, push to talk being off on default. Which typically would be nice, but still uh, would be nice if that was asked beforehand. Anyways, uh, I think this one wasn't released before that. Anyways, here we have the rift, and these wisps of light show the ways that the enemies will be going. And unlike uh, Orcs Must Die 1, we'll see a lot more difference in the environments and, and hazards. And we're starting out in the mines here, of course, so there will be minecart traps. Not really traps, like more just random minecarts going all over the place. Yeah. And we need to stop them from getting over here. So at first, we only have uh, we only have three slots available here. Drakir has one more because yeah, he grinded a bit. We start off with his shotgun. Yeah, tower I trap, the the arrow roll. Uh, in the first game, we always had the sword equipped, no matter what, that they released at this time, or released you from the restriction. Up here, we have the enemies that will be coming, the medium orc warriors, single-minded brute who heads for the rift, and the heavy orc warriors, with the same description. And these guys will just beeline for the doors, and we don't want them to get out. Indeed. And then maybe have me. Yeah, the sorceress. The enemy uh, of the first game uh, now forced to work together with her sworn enemy, the war mage. Let's see. Yeah, we won't be... Oh, hello. We can change... On the minimap you can see that the line for the the, the, the green line changed, which is which signifies the, the path that the minecart is taking. We should be able to affect... Uh, other traps and hazards in later levels as well. Step into my sprinklers, little orcs. Yeah, and the war mates and sorceress both have their own traps, though I've, there is some overlap. Yeah, they are similar, but with uh, their own twists, basically. For now, there isn't really too much we can do to force them down a specific path, and we'll just have to face them head on. So, I'm ready. Yep. Oh, and don't forget, since I grind this level, I learned something about the sorcerer's secondary spell here. Yeah. Well, be beside its charms. Apparently, once the or charmed orc dies, it explodes and stuns everything around them. Okay, and so there's still a good use for me to just shoot them the moment they're charged. They're well, charmed. They're more. If they are too weak, they also explode if they're not getting stunned. Okay. So basically, I turned the shoulder into a bomb. Oh, so another little quality of life thing with the with in this game now is that every trap shows its area of effect. Yeah, and I mean, you know, it's in the other game as well, but only for a short moment. Yeah, like when you were placing them. Yeah. And the the sorceress has these acid the sprayers, which are basically like the arrow traps. And instead of tar traps, she has these ice vents, which will, well, of course, freeze enemies. Yep. And yes, there's a reason I put my traps near this cart. Yeah. I know be that you can get. Oh yeah, I noticed that you can get some very high combo points from doing so. Especially uh, in communication with charming them and make them fight in mid of the track. Okay. Big record is speaking. Oh, oh yeah, uh, oh yeah, oh. Time to go to work. How about that? Yeah, we have the shotgun instead of a crossbow this time, because, well, we kind of killed magic last time. But that means that instead, technology has been pushing. There's the charm, and go. Yeah, you see what I mean. I've been very happy to pick those things near the traps. Or we can stay near the tracks. The 
shotgun secondary is a grenade. It will knock them all around the place, of course. And possibly over ledges for an instant kill. We're back on the track. Go, first rave done. Uh, let's just put down Arrows some for everyone. We'll get barricades it's later to herd them around the areas. Knock a few over the ledge when we can. Even when we don't get a kill with the shotgun, it'll be able to knock a few over. Another heavy hit hit by car? We can't get hit by the car ourselves. basically of well us comboing traps together and well shooting them Is that a trap? I'm the day. right <laughs> combo <laughs> and yeah the more items that are affecting a core when they die the higher the combo is including our own attacks This is yeah. Like for now, I think the sorceress events might be better than car base. They need to recharge. It's, it's well shown in the health bar of a trap. Yep. Ow! <laughs> Yeah, that's that with the cards. I just remember you should have put the trap more behind the cards here as well. Yeah, that's where we can come in ourselves. Traps are to the traps are in the mouth. Okay, every now and then we get a, a mid wave where we have some time to redesign our stuff. For now it, it won't change too much. Warning, we'll they cause death. A few more of these. And one of those. Who get the money for that? Oh well. Yeah, yeah, these drops are basically mana, which is required for the special attacks. And well, of course, health. Yep. And you see a skull? Grab it. Extra yeah, that's point. extra points. Oh, well, right. extra it's skulls to unlock stuff with. Or we'll upgrade stuff with, more likely. Actively. Nice and all up. Yeah, if, if we kill them without any traps, then we don't get the combo. Uh, left there, you can see a little counter number that was basically extra, yeah, extra cash from the kill streak, More fun you kill them all at once. which can stack up quite big if you start killing them in the in number. make them stay inside the trap room. It seems that the arrow traps will load faster. It might just be the imagined things. Do you think Atom do more damage? Kills <laughs> me! Round and no. I still got some of them. And there we go. 
well done. We get the skulls depending on our score. And I won one. Yeah, because you already completed this. Yeah, uh, no. I think five no. is when you get through without lose with with full rift health and full uh, without getting hit yourself. But it might just be entirely score based, which I don't know. I think it's a bit score based for I have done it without damage and anything else. And just got four scores out of five. Then when I got one score by meta, so we just got all five scores and many extra scores from that. Uh, yeah. With those skulls, we can take a look at our equipment. And okay. so this is not hmm. Okay, here is where we upgrade things and unlock things. Okay, steam trap, coin forge and a boom barrel. Okay, I'd forgotten that this is how you unlock stuff more of your own choosing instead of having to rely on the progression alone. Yeah, uh, shall we uh, upgrade something? Trinkets. Okay, I've never really looked at any of these, I think. Um, let's see. I can switch between different types here. And out. <laughs> Pumpkin head. Okay, okay, just for fun. Oh no! Weapons of Misastral, Blade Staff. Uh, I only have six skulls, so there's nothing really much to unlock or upgrade. So we can continue on. Alright, so we skip the upgrading for now then. to continue, all right. I was looking for a to continue. Wait, Sorceress is do it with charm. <laughs> of course. Hey, Let's look, see if it's Echo Slough. I thought I closed all those. Where are we? What are these tunnels? We're in the Dwarven Mines, where I work. You're a miner now? It's not like I had an in-demand skill set beyond the whole ill orcs cast spells thing. Plus, Turns out, people weren't exactly grateful when I shut off the magic juice. What? Right. echo? It didn't echo. Uh, oh, good. Then it means my settings did work. Just it said it does not work for the cutscene. Yeah. Just plugging my phone into the charger. Because the battery is apparently almost dying. But uh, yeah, this is apparently an outfit that I have. Probably from just the DLC that I got along with this. I also have, also have a, a Halloween outfit. So I, yeah, I prefer this one due to like, Halloween outfit is six in all. Just I'm not a fan of the hair. Okay. Again, we can send the minecart a different path, and yeah, now it's starting to get a bit. This is one of the things that suggest to me that this game is designed from the ground up to be co-op because I played through this originally solo and had quite a difficult time with it at points. Uh, oh yeah, I, I tried and it is it does get a bit difficult. I think we should focus our defense in the middle here since all of them will come here anyways. I put up one up there as a, you know, thinner. else we can do at the moment. Uh, actually, I think I made a I like the layer and place it down stuff, but otherwise there's no lag. So I think it's just a slight delay due to your multiplayer when you're putting down things. Okay, uh, did you pick up the, the spike trap? Because I forgot to. We got, we... I, I have it. I have it. Okay. Uh, yeah, also, our mana our, yeah, our coins in the lower left. Uh, we don't share those, we each get our own supply of those. Uh, but yeah, I forgot to pick it up so I have a free slot open and I can't open the spell book again to grab it. Maybe if I sell these? Nope. Okay, that's just, just a mistake then. Um, oh well. Yeah, you can't uh, do it until next match. Okay, I'm ready. Stabbing time! Where am I? Here they come. Come on, 
over here. We should probably wait for them down here. Once we do that, I'll lower the game volume a bit more. There. Yeah, it was, that was because there was all tap probably. Run the stairs. Okay. You try to actually shoot the pink ones with the Jaws spell. Okay. What you really want to do is to shoot the smaller ones with the Jaws spell. Due to that. Yeah, that also works. Yeah, it's just that they, they die quickly and come on a monster. Step right this way, Mr. Ork. Yeah. The game's also being a bit stingy with the coins. Let's go! It's, again, seeing as we don't share the amount. Just to me that you are really just supposed to play this game in co-op from the start to finish. Let's see if we should probably stop luring them down here. Be careful with the knife factions. This time it throws them into an open area where they can just run through. Serve to their death. <laughs> okay. He's got thrown around. And go back in. Nice. Okay. More of these. Let's put the fight tra traps by the door here. Okay. Bring it! This should help send them out. Because once they get past here onto the bridges, we only have floor traps to deal with them. We're on the stairs! Yeah, I have to call the fight trap here to hopefully I have some help. Uh, yeah, being able to place traps on angled surfaces is also something new in this game. I think your charm spell might be more useful, or at least more generally useful. Then my uh, yeah. knockback grenade. Yeah, it, it is usual when you use it at the right moment. It, it, it keeps them busy uh, no matter what. The, the knockback grenade is only really too useful if you can knock yeah, them. Boom goes the dice. <laughs> if you can knock them uh, into a hazard. Like catnip, but for orcs. Yeah, I can see, uh, see that they are picking. And yep. we, we can't, however, place traps on slopes. We can put them on slope next to the walls on slopes, but we can't put the traps on the slopes themselves. There we go. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. I, I th we overlooked something here. Overlooked what? Hold the shoot. <laughs> uh, yeah. Hello. Some levels yeah, will have hazards like that that we can set off by shooting them. Let's look. Is there any more around? I didn't see any. Uh, there is no more. Dude, that is will be very useful as an emergency. Yeah, uh, you might want to sell that sprayer, by the way, since only half of the orcs will run into it. And again, so it's the same with these on the walls. Yeah, we put this somewhere else. Let's see. Uh, you can use it for spike traps. Yeah, I can afford two more spike traps for that. Okay. The perfect spot. 
Really? Is it really clean? Sharp, sure, but clean? Uh, it won't be once the orcs start running into it. Uh, true. Right. Ready? Yeah. Stab it, Tom. Okay, they're coming from the left. Let's let them run into the traps first. Yeah, I, I, I really want you to get shot, Bell, when they are in need of a green. Oh, elemental! I hear when you kill them, you just make more. Enemy list at the start. Uh, yeah, rock elementals, first elementals, uh, one of the two. Once they kill them, they split into two. Like this will show it in a second. Go. And yeah, the, the spawns from it are faster. Mistakes. Oh, who am I kidding? I didn't make any. Put up some to thin their herds a bit. Food fight! There you go. I've added more spikes over here. And wait. Hit me up. Yeah. The root of trap has repealed. Yeah. I th I'm not sure if it's a one per round or it's just recharged on its own. I guess we'll find out once they get here. Yeah, I'm glad that that one did kill us a bit in the right now. It's more fun to kill them all at once. Okay, one of them got flung by the cart. <laughs> I just need to wait for a third of them to get through. Oh, I should probably make them fuck up under it. Alright. There we go. Oh, you killed him. There we go. And yeah, it's resetting on its own, so we can use it multiple times. Oh, nice. And there we go. <laughs> and that time we got to see your avatar animation. <laughs> Pick up the bear dancer of us too. And this level unlocked. Endless levels are a great way to earn new skulls and improve your character. Visit the campaign screen to play endless levels. We're not going to because we're here for the story. Yep. Uh, should we upgrade something? And looking at the moment, I have an, I have 16 skulls. I also I'm not seeing the barricade, so we'll probably get that one for free. Yeah, it's locked off. But I can get a favorite from the previous game. And also, this time you can upgrade. Your, you can upgrade your traps multiple times. Yeah, are you getting all the ballista? Yeah, I'm getting the wall blades. Oh, yeah, I accepted a war blade. And we got well, six I've bonus got... skulls from that. Okay. I didn't see any get dropped, though. Uh, let's see. I can also should buy the war blades, though I suspect I should probably buy something else. Just to keep our traps mixed. Yeah. I can afford a Paladin Guardian. Uh, those have been proven to be useful in the previous game, so... Yeah, you could go for that, but it's your choice. Yeah, I was trying to look over as a mana bell. Okay. Scor Scorcher is tempting. You know what? I would take Scorcher. And let's see, we got the healing trinket. Slowly regenerates health. That active will 
be a big help. It did it say something on the side there? Let's see. The chasm, falling, lava, and acid kills count as trap kills. Okay. What's your deal, anyway? Why'd you send all those orcs through the rift? The order mages were weak and old, unwilling to rule as they should. The orcs were a tool to carve away the corruption and filth. So, made your power trip, huh? I got it. Your tower does square. Okay, we have a lot less room this time, and only one wall on each side. Yeah, I had done this one, and bloody hell, it's gonna hopefully be more okay. easy. I hope. Medium orc warrior and the kobold runners, fast on me who sprints for the rifts, and the same beyond that. Let's. Uh. Spike yeah, trap you have a spike and... trap, so I guess I will skip spike trap myself and go for the hidden trinket, perhaps. Okay, I'll take the wall blades. Oh, yeah, I will, I will skip that spike trap. Or yeah, the wall blades won't be too useful here since we can't funnel them in. Well, not to be good at that. <clears throat> Pardon. You gotta go with both the scorcher. Yeah. Okay, I'll just line the arrows, walls with arrows. I should hit any of them that gets through there. Yeah, I suspect a scorcher should be good here. Yeah, I think maybe a bit back more, but it, it is your choice. They'll, you can see by the whip, the, by the lines, the where the <clears throat> which will be the most populated route. Yeah, as I see If they were too close here. Yeah, they get the, they may risk getting rammed by the cars. Yeah, it's going to be a lot more stronger on this side than the other, probably. Yeah, now we put a wall trap here. A perfect fit. So it's going to be angled. Okay. Wall blades really only get more useful uh, once you get barricades to funnel them to paths, and we can't build on top of these. So yeah, that sort of limits how my that limits how where we could funnel them through, anyways. If we can yeah. funnel them across the <laughs> across the rails, that put them in a big da danger from the mine parts. <laughs> I hope we get to do that. Yeah. All right. You're in them? Yeah. Keep it coming. Okay. And these two make a pair, I swear. Okay. A knockback is going to be a lot more useful here. Oh, that was a runner. Ran straight into my hail. <laughs> into the hail of my shotgun. And <laughs> there goes a pack flying, but only about. <laughs> And there goes another one that gets sent back to the rift. Okay. If we do get some percent of shared money between each other. Oh. No. Sweet! Hey, okay, other side. I hope nobody gets hurt. No, I don't. Explode on contact or after a short amount of time. Okay. Actually, we probably should have switched that. Not that these got anywhere close to us, anyways. Oh, yeah! I'm awesome! 
Okay, now they're going to come from both sides. Time to go to work. Okay. Clap first. What's a healing potion doing there? And those guys almost got sent back. Oh, other side. Punch over the ledge. Oh, runner. Yeah, that's all I am. Ah, that was, yeah, that was one of the extra skulls that we can pick up. Uh, <laughs> it was a bit too close for it to really get a look on it. Okay. Let the cold take them. So putting down spike traps just in case they get past us. More acid. Okay. These orcs must die. Don't go, sir. Don't go, sir. I just blow them up and almost knock them over. Okay, on the side. You said I just said come around. Okay, that was a triple kill. Look at them running when they get burned! <laughs> okay, that was a miss. Oh, come on! Them caught fish in the miss that. Uh, this That's place gonna leave a mark. More. What the? Let's roll. Oh. What? Was that open or something now? No, we don't. We're not facing ogres yet. I'm not even sure if there are ogres. There are ogres, trust me. Uh, it, it, it wouldn't make too much sense for them to not bring back some uh, enemies like that. Oh, 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 oh. They burn! Badly! Oh. Yeah, we shot that one. Uh, one of them got through. Not you. Certainly not you. Welcome to Kill Streak City. Population. And there we go. <laughs> and I think the pumpkin just phased out of existence for half a second. <laughs> Spring trap. Let's go back to normal. And let's see. We have nine. So that won't be enough to really upgrade or unlock something. So there's brimstone. Horse traps would be useful if there weren't railings. So yeah, let's continue on. The crossing. This one I'm not done. Okay, so here we're starting well, completely fresh on your end. I've, you know, as I said, I've already played through this game, but I won't remember everything about it. Okay, shoot the targets near the minecarts, which the dwarf Brighteneers can perform melee attacks if needed. And it also said something about These hunters. Rifts just keep popping up. No matter. As more rifts appear, our powers grow. Together we will sweep the orcs aside. 
done what? We get married? Pop out a little army of war mage babies? I would sooner rip your beating heart from your chest. Yeah, I get that a lot. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit more because the sound seems to be very low compared to us okay let's see now we have the spring trap not to be confused with the certain yeah, the spring trap from a certain uh, <clears throat> other franchise and let's see. we also have crossbow orcs now noel hunters ranged enemy targets war mates and guardians Dangerous fast moving enemy hunts down war mages. And here's the earth elementals. Splits when killed into two earthlings. And ogres. Takes lots of punishments, counts for five red points. So we want to stop those at all costs. Yeah. Not hate them. Mate, they really made news even scarier here. They actually gonna be crazy. They also introduced them far earlier. Okay, at this right. point in time we don't really have uh, a single choke point, I think. Let's take a look around. Yeah, we have a door here and a door there. And th this is the level that pretty much solidified for me that this is 100% supposed to be played in co-op. Yep, listen, we do have the breach where we can put the, you know, feeling me a song. Yeah. Oh, you can put it there, up there as well. Must be at least oh. this tall to ride. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now I am biffed. Okay. Probably not the best to start with those. And then we'll start with the arrow traps as usual. And we'll, yeah, probably best if we just split our attention. That you take the lower road and I take the high road, and actually. Shouldn't work on this one yet because they're going to come from down from there. And here yeah, there yeah. are no walls to put traps on. Well there's one, but only one. Yeah. So Step into my sprinklers, little orcs. Yeah, it's these, huh? If they try to sneak by they can get hit by the Oh wait, th there are some walls near the door itself. This could be good. Maybe. We should so mostly we prefer one to not get them, to, yeah, not have them this close, though. Yeah, I put them there as a just in case. And I put this is where most of our here. defense should be. Yep. Okay, once they start showing up from both sides, I'll take the high road since I can just launch those downstairs. Alright. Okay, now I'm ready. Out of the frying pan into my fire. Dibs on the orcs! Oh, we oh god. Okay, here come the crossbow wars. These have been very annoying in the last game. They just literally if you have them stand in the way of the caught on my end. Uh, and there's a no hunter. Uh, okay, he comes straight. <laughs> Run down, down, doggy. Okay, they they are a lot more noticeable this time. And that was just dumb for me. And yeah, dying cost crit points as well. So there's no, there's absolutely no gain in suiciding. Now they're coming over here. Pass it twice, cut once. And that was probably the first smart you guys thing that the warmate said. Wait, what did he say? Measure twice, cut once. Yeah, that is a smart thing. again. Get over there. Got 
kill you myself then. Oh, uh, yeah, they. The, the nulls, no, they're not coming from your end just yet. It's the usual split. Uh, yeah, the nulls attacks also slow you down. Which, of course, makes you an easier prey to them. Not too many new lines. Warning so may cause death. Killing season. Okay. Probably going to come from both sides now. Here they come. Shall we need assistance? Yes. And it's a bit of the rail. Yeah, I'm getting points from your team streaks and all that, so we are somewhat sharing points. Yeah, we share a lot of but not expensive. Uh, planning was something I did. Yeah, luckily enough. A little present for you, one for you, yeah, and one for you. Also, something I just noticed is that the sorceress has less health but more magic, which makes sense. Yeah, that does make sense. Okay. Best to keep the minecart going that way, since that is the most vulnerable path. Work. You ready, boss? Yeah. Let's go. Okay. Oh, elementals. Those guys are going to tank the arrows for the rest of them. I found a rooftop uh, on the here. And there's one that's going to be as well. Alright. Can you can you charm the mole? I think I have. Uh, it was attacking a charm target. There. Okay. Hold them back. Yes. No. Yep. <laughs> Never mind. It got run over. Pushed over by the arrows. Not in my house. Okay. Let's finally put some of these down. <laughs> or one of these. <laughs> Time to dance. Oh, ogre, ogre. I can't come to Ogre! Actually, so many Ogre near the group is probably a good idea. Drop the coin. Better coin than uh, points. Any more points for you guys, right? There goes a big one. <laughs> uh, let's put down another one. Spring trap. Filling your dreams of flights at 1139. 
Oh, oh. Ogre here, ogre wow. here. Coming. They're almost there. Winning. Once again, I overlooked the trap, the hazard traps. I told you about it. <laughs> Let's go. What the heck happened? Oh, God. Okay, some, some of them are landing on the bridge, though, from the spring traps. Yeah, <laughs> they immediately they... got nailed by the carts. Yeah, so they just fly past the bridge. I think I like my strategy is going to come on the bridge. Uh, it's always funny to just see the nope get pushed over by the arrow traps. I was going to go after that single one, but then he got flung more so. Now how many was that? Nah, who cares? Okay. Almost got through. Almost. There we go. Last level, last yeah. <clears throat> last round. Okay. Well, uh, what do you think of my trap system over here? Yeah, it looks good enough. <laughs> Ready? Almost. Just putting down two more of these. Okay, ready? Ready. Whenever you guys are ready. Okay, one thing I do dislike a bit about this game, though, is that the orcs have a lot less variety in their appearance. Hello there. It's just something fucking hilarious about seeing orcs <laughs> fly. There are a bunch of them still land with you. Oh, see my lot. Thanks, bro. Okay. It's happening. Where do you adapt? Oh, I spy the ogre. I spotted them as well and shot them. <laughs> hey, yeah, my side is clear, coming to help. Okay, if you can just continuously charm an ogre, then, <laughs> then that would be very yeah, useful. <laughs> For that, of course, you're limited to your, by your mana amount. Okay, the Dwarf Guardian throws explosive bombs at enemies. Woo! My kinsmen are here! It's... Yeah. Are they really going to wait long for, to give us the barricades? Yeah, I think it's uh, in the story. Actually, let's see. Let's see. Upgrades. Just some damage. Set enemies on fire. Sometimes chill or do some good. Arrow trap. Oh, well. Arrow walls can now be placed on ceilings. Okay, that is dangerous. I'm just going to upgrade the damage setting for now, though. I've got 10 scores and I can up do some upgrades. As I can make my acid sprayer shoot further. And it can even obviously make slows down targets. Uh, the slowing down might be more useful. Mm. Again, your choice, your spells. Uh, I'm getting the feeling that besides the first uh, rep, the first traps, there might not be too much difference between these two anyways. So we'll, yeah. we'll have to see. 
Uh, you also got the Dwarf Guardians? Yep. Okay, so it might just be the starting spells. Oh well. It's, I mean... Upgrade the damage, and add it so you can do slow, and save the two remaining skulls. Okay, big valleys. Oh, are we getting the... I think we're getting the, yeah, the barricades here. Haymakers are effective against flyers that fly close to something, the ceiling probably. Using trinkets will make you a better player. So, I thought only the oldest living war mage could open new rifts. Isn't that you? What exactly are you implying? We're the last two war mages. You're old. Er, older than me. Mm-hmm. Not like ancient or anything. I mean, you're still looking good. Really? Tell me more. I think I've made my point here. Okay. okay, we're not getting the barricades, but there are some you know, standards. We can't swap parts uh, right now, but we can well, just shoot them to unload their <laughs> load. I know exactly what we need here. His name is... Rockgar! Oh, I love the sign. <laughs> uh, did you hear what he said? Wait, wait, what did he say? For the hordes. Wait, wrong game. What the heck? No, be no, no more beer for you. Okay, these barricades are very haphazard. Oh, oh dear. Oh, this is a good one here. Just, uh, yeah, making them go down a path like this. Where there isn't any room to put anything on top of it. And can we actually... No, actually, so far the line is going the other path. Uh, yeah, but the other one is going to open up soon enough. Yeah. And then they're probably going yeah. to go what? down all routes. Um, here we are. Look at the roof. Yeah. What is that big round thing? A uh, hanging bomb. <laughs> oh! And That's since it really has a health bar, I assume those reload as well. Let's see if that. Yeah. I guess we should put some traps here. Yeah, in this game, it's a lot harder to just bottleneck them through one part. Sweet burn start. of acid. How I love it. Let's see, there's... Unless... Oh, wait, I did a paper walk, no wonder. I think I'll pick the Dwarf Nerf Guardian as well. Um, let's put one over here. I hope the Dwarves will fight in melee as well, beside throwing bombs. Yeah, it says they're doing one of the, the loading screens, I think. And, well, they do have a big-ass hammer to deal with that as well. It's a dragon hammer. Bloody awesome. <laughs> Minor points for the Hornet helmet, but otherwise I do think they're cool. Uh, let's see. Ooh, pointy! Okay, apparently they, he gives a different sound bite to you because I heard over, I heard over your microphone. I heard him say, uh, "Who likes traps or something?" I do, I do. But on my screen, he said, "Who likes pointy things?" <laughs> mm, okay, I'll save a little bit of money to put blades on these two. They are moving about, the dwarves. If you get close to them. Okay, yeah, they'll, they'll, they move out of your way, unlike in the original. Okay, I'm blind. And over here we have a boulder shoot again. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. This is where it's going to get tricky. Hey, look, room service! 
Yeah, it's gonna get tricky. I hope I didn't put my on a bad spot, though. He probably would be useful for something. Arches is very case. Did he see us in the wall over the barricade? No, he got knocked over. Hey, that gives a big ass boom. But it does. Okay. I'm guessing it refills at the, s at the start of the next round. And break. It has not. Okay, so the bombs might be one time use after all. You. What? Why do you waste it? Three. Okay. Oh, we forgot to check it. We forgot to check the new enemies. Now we lose the Sapphires, which basically suicide their way into the nearest trap they can find. This is typically a bear thing. Okay. Ooh, okay, yeah, now they're coming in big numbers. And yeah, no, <laughs> those barricades don't help much anymore. Anyway. Yeah, these guardians can get killed by the enemy, which will actually not permanently remove, but will run out until the next save uh, round. have to mostly rely on the guardians for, uh, for this since there's just too many paths for them to split off into okay the, the narration also said it they are just knocked out not killed Going good. Oh, the summer gun got past you. They're in the West Hall. And yeah, this shows what happens when you block off a path entirely. The block entrance to the portal entirely, they'll start attacking the barricades. I heard something there. It's like a word or something. Uh, we so need to figure out what the heck we need to do here now. You see, the best thing we might be able to do is to put the. to just focus up everything at the end here. I think traps will do less for us here. Okay, at least these barricades should slow them down for a bit. So we can just fire across over them. Well, where they haven't been broken open, of course. And don't forget about the carts going around. You can shoot them to pour fire down. Only on the outside of the circuit, apparently. Now, hope these 
definitely lose some of yeah, but what the heck? Wait, I need to... Hmm? So, so... He killed the blind me. Plot the timing. Sappers. Okay, my guardians can be the last line. In the meantime, I'll support over here. Nice yeah. okay, those grenades won't do much if they done. don't hit. I'll see them all burn. Okay, more sappers. At least we get a big warning before they really drive. When they start spawning. Once they have made a pass through somewhere, they won't That's attack any further barricades along that path. So they basically choke point themselves. I think the second flame trap here might be a bit useless because it won't go off as it is now. Let's just well, move uh, all of you closer. Yeah, I planned to sell some of the traps, but... Right, no, yeah, wait. Me. Can you sell oh, during this time? Oh, we oh, Not anymore now. Okay, Sappers down the middle. Not all of them. And yeah, they just... They killed themselves in a barricade. Oh, we are just regular cobalts. are very easy to kill. Okay. We might be a bit wasted here as well.
like that these earthling elementals fall apart if you knock them down. <laughs> and they're, they're, all, they're, all, they're all Okay. Okay, yeah, now we can find another cell. Uh, yeah, I think you want to remove this one here. Yeah, that one Ready. is what they want to do as a cell. Okay, if we keep any sappers from the middle, we should be able to just uh, do it with... Hmm. Trap. We should be able to just make it uh, with all of them coming down these two paths. So you... Let me bunch you all up a bit. Okay, four here and <laughs> a bunch more here. Five. Five. And I might as well put an extra ever trap here. And then the last one. Actually, not. Might as well stick there it there, then. For Actually, no. Let's stick it... ...here. It should still hit them with a good amount of their arrows. I hope the sneaky placement of uh, ice and fire crops will be of use. Oh dear. What's about to get off? What is that? Uh, yeah. Three sappers. We've lost the dwarf! Kill streak! Okay. That was too early. Okay, just come, trying to come down the sides. Just out of sync with works again. Okay, you got, you got the right side. Kill streak! I got the right side, yes. See? Okay. And a bunch are coming down the middle. They're almost there! Are they splitting? No, they are attacking. Right. They are splitting up. Okay. Yeah, the original pod may be blocked, but they can Kill still find a pod. Yeah, the is going to be a very useful reward since, uh, yeah, make it easier for them to hold the grenades at the phone. Okay, one more. fast enough to go past some traps. That one should be Them come back here. Yeah, right, 
No, you don't. Also, every time those uh, earth elementals die or earth stuff, it sounds like a bowling pin getting hit. Welcome to Kill Streak City. Population? Those guys. Okay. That was a lot harder solo. Yeah, and Nonstick got past and he got barricades. And seven bonus scones. Okay. I got I got total of eight bonus and total of three, yeah, twelve new skulls. Ooh, and what yeah, we finally got the barricades. Let's see, what can we upgrade now? Reduced to 800, take reduced damage, self repair. Let's begin with just making these things cheaper because we're going to want a lot of them. And at least only six. Okay. Okay, cost reduced to 800. Wait, had they made them more expensive to begin with? I think so. Because, well, it is a lot easier to use barricades to guide you know, to guide enemies through certain traps instead of well, having to fill the entire place for traps. Do you want to be the barricader? Yeah, I've already upgraded the cost uh, two times now. Alright, then you uh, get let me be the barricader. Uh, wait, no, it's better put um, it down to something else. Uh, what should I upgrade them? Um, you can reset the skulls if you want at the bottom of the spell book. That I remember. I can upgrade so I can use the ice vent on ceiling. Okay. Oh, ice vent reset time reduced. Yes, please. I'm gonna freeze a lot longer. Also useful. And I've upgraded one more on the reset time reduced on the ice trap. And yeah, I imagine ice traps will be them useful. Over time, yeah. Okay, hidden gold. Strolls are vulnerable to lightning damage. Trolls, wait, wait, not ogres. More orcs. Let's go. You're okay. enjoying this. So are you. Yes, I am. <laughs> okay, let's have a look for this time. Upcoming enemies, the usual. And yeah, here they are. The Cobalt Sappers, Fast Enemy who tries to blow up War Mages, Guardians and Barricades. I have played this one on the Unlimited run. I tried it and good gods, it's chaotic. <laughs> and we've got Bile Bats. Bile Breathing Flying Enemy avoids floor traps. Pity. I just have an idea. Should we put the dwarves with the elves? Uh, there are... I'm not sure if there... Oh, yes, they are here. Uh, you didn't notice them, did you? No, I only now just looked around a bit more. Uh, yeah, you could put dwarves up with them. I'm picking the barricades. I don't know if I got more... Uh, yeah, more spell slots whilst I was playing this solo. But yeah, it does make some sense to have you know, less when you're playing with yeah, another player. Otherwise you'd have too yeah. much of a choice in spells. Can you imagine that it's split between us? They go now with Archer and Dwarfs up there, so we, we probably be the ones doing the most of the work at start, but... Yeah, the dwarves I imagine will do quite a good work once we get the traps going. Luckily, yours can't jump! And of course, the barricades. Okay, I'm going to test something. Will they still move past? Okay, yes. Yeah, they will, They can move more. Previously, they could also move past the barricades a little easier. Uh, or they could also move past barricades with uh, one space gap between them, but they'd mostly still go around. Alright, and I'm actually we want to block a pot to force them all uh, into the same pot then. Yeah. 
We'll probably yeah, seal it up here, since that'll force them you know, to go down. That'll force them to pass the archer and grenadier and near this guy before they turn around and go over here again. Yeah, make them force uh, to go back to the same death traps. Yeah. Actually, it might be it might be better to seal this one off because then they are heading face first towards the you know, the mine cards. Which will, well, be a bigger chance of them hitting it. Yeah, that's true. If they're running after it, then they have a much bigger window. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm going to save up my... Uh, I'm saving up for to seal off one of the passages. So... I'm not placing anything down just yet. Stabbing time! Down the course on each uh here. Hopefully it will be open hell. Yeah, ragdolls never <laughs> get uh, ragdolls never get not fun. They're coming from the other side. Or the other side. Kill streak. Okay, left again. and put them back a bit more to waste it. just a little bit more of their time. Whenever you guys are ready! I'll back. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, now the flyers come. So they removed the headshot mechanic from, from the last game. I'm a bit more neutral on that. Oh, that's a little bit Oh, pile bats are going left, right. Just be, you know, a bit hot and cold. And nope, I'm not gonna sing the song. Stand they definitely made these a lot more pricey. Probably to, probably to lessen people's reliance on them. And that already balanced out the payouts a bit. My liquid went roasted. Uh -oh. 
something for your face. Okay. No more ignore. Oh, that's the sort of charm. But in short, so both will attack everyone else. Bow rats are down. I'll focus on them. Of course, it makes them focus me. And behind. Things are a lot more expensive. Here we go. Aha, uh -huh. it is the main path. Alright. Uh. Uh, maybe it is better to focus most of the traps here. Yeah. Or at least gonna... behind here. Yeah. We'll be able to deal with the bile rats ourselves when they show up here. Yeah, remove some of these. I will leave some of them behind. Uh, let's see here. Just to reduce some number of them. But I will start making the main traps over here. Yeah. I'll put down one more barricade and then I'll start lengthening the paths here. Here would be a good sp uh, spot for a spread your trap. Yeah, oh yeah, here should be perfect. That there, that there. Then when I can afford, I put the fire trap there. Okay. Oh, 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 we have one little problem though. Uh, just uh -huh. stand up here and check the wisps. They're, head they're going to change their path to here. Up here, of all things. Then, if I do, actually, we're I'm going to need two to block this off. Okay. Yes, you do. It is weakening the past there, but that is ensuring that they. Okay, we can put barricades and slopes. And Trapping. guitar traps. Okay, why could we not do that? Pretty sure we. Did we even try to put those <laughs> down earlier? I just did it. That's that down compression. Did we even try? Okay, then I, yeah, I stand corrected. You can put traps and slopes. I, I was just to actually no in the previous game it wasn't slopes. You had to deal with stairs all the time, which of course aren't <laughs> flat enough to put traps on. Yeah, Do it looks. It sounds a bit stupid to put a tall trap on a slope. in their appearance, but again, not as much as uh, the previous game. I think we have flyers coming. The, the, the dwarves are under attack and <laughs> just an entire row of them. Uh, yeah, I got the flyers, I got the flyers. You take them, I 
Yeah, I use my shot and what the heck just damaged the Okay, I mean you know Yeah, the archers have been damaging the barricades. I assume they have us, I think. You should not use the mod. The orcs are accident. Oh, I should. I see what's happening. When I shot them too close to the barricade, they hit the barricade. Okay, that is a problem. Yeah, now we're in, now we're in some trouble. One, two, five, kind of Okay, when barricades are destroyed, they aren't refunded. So they are a big investment to lose. Okay, you didn't see that, but one of the cores got stuck behind the behind the boards. Oh. Killing season. Okay. Oh dear. Yeah, no charming until they can't get past them. Basically, if I don't show them, don't show them too close to the warp barricade. Oh, hello. They're in the west hall. Okay, different color, darker. It could just be because everything here is darker. They're in the east hall. Don't do that! That's what you do! Kill broke a barricade. Oh, and we have sappers. Wait. Don't tell me we have sappers out of the yard. Don't know. I'm guessing your spells, you know, your normal attack doesn't deal as much damage. Because I can just shoot, take these out with a shot each. I should probably wait faster than you do, but that's yeah. It's not very useful for the tank your bows. You focus the ground, I focus the air. That's a lot of dead orcs! I think it might be best to pull back the guardians. I would have put down two. But they've been knocked out every time. Again. Oh dear. Okay, uh, might be best to sell all of these here. Yep, never mind, too late. Time to go to work. Oh, and they, bro they broke through here as well. Okay, you take the right. They they weakened barricades as usefulness a face. lot. Uh, yeah, orcs that are standing on top of the four scorchers will get thrown. Activate. Flyers. Sappers. At least there are now. Wow, that's a lot of death. Team that lock monster kill. Only for a 25 skill streak. Okay, the dwarves can actually 
throw them and get them in the air with their grenades. And I think not a single one got through. Indeed, one of us close! A couple almost snuck past me, but I shot him in the neck. Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm going to block this off again. Well, okay, we got a big... We got a lot of cast this time. time. Actually, probably not there. We may just sneak around it. Okay. And the past is restored. Uh, yeah, if the, your dwarves pass in front of this, you might want to pull back and put up here or something. What? Uh, you might want to pull your dwarves back here while they, where the enemy will be a lot more folk, uh, concentrated together. Well, here's the problem. I don't think I can reach them. I put them next to the elves, remember? Yeah, you could jump and try to sell them. Yeah. A bit more distance. That's not working, and... Bloody heck, I did not know they had these kind of skirt mechanics on that back in the years. You might want to be a bit more distance from the wall. <laughs> okay, you still have these traps here. They're only going to like half of them. Yeah, and the better half than the, everyone. Uh, just too many come at us at once. And then you could put those down here as well. Yeah, I could probably do that. Or just put a bunch of dwarves behind it here. I probably think I just put a damn massive line of ice and fire traps over here, along with these acid traps. Okay. Yeah, if we hadn't lost those barricades, I could have made a pass over here to yeah, waste their time even more as they run back and forth. Yeah, look, I cannot glad we did learn that there, that there is some uh, drawbacks with the charm spell. Yeah. Otherwise, it would probably be a bit OP. So, yeah. Be careful with the... Sh um, uh, yeah, I need to be careful with the, with the two near the barricades. Otherwise, I just turn the damn orcs into a grenade. Okay. Are you going to move these, or shall we start? Uh, we should start. Uh, I, I think I prefer having them uh, just in case. Start time! Uh, yeah, it's if we reduce the numbers. Yeah, I was just going to say that the dwarves seem to leave their targets, but then one of them bounced. Grenade off the ledge. And we got flyers. Also sending them. They're in the east wall. And on to the south. They're almost there. Flyers. That was on the way. Out, sappers. I'm on the fence. Oh, flyers, flyers. Second lost. I'll stop them in their tracks. They won't get past me. Never mind, That's me. Since they're not wasting their time with this place, play the safety place in the there. 
and one day forward in the distance got nailed by the minecart. Surprise! Now how many was that? Nah, who cares? And flyers. Blessing to them, it's a bit of a curse to us. Oh, wait, yeah, now I get it. But in this case, it keeps them away from my dwarves up here. We've lost the dwarves! No! Okay, those vile bastards are pretty strong against dwarves. Because the grenades take a bit of time to travel. And I think this LP has been alive since the start. Yeah! She and his uh, brother. Yes! And that's because this guy gets it nuked the entire time. Time to go to work! And finally, we get to see the wall blades. And that's a strike. At the moment, I'm not reachable by them anymore. The yeah, you, they, they can hit it as well if you're in there. Hey, no, no, they, they came behind me. <laughs> yeah, if you can bottleneck them, then you can move. It's a it's a straight up move force multiplier. And what that basically means for you not even know is, is that whatever you put uh, into fuel, then you will double, triple, perhaps even four times as much damage. Force, as one could say. Incoming oh, that's a lot of archers. Yeah! A lot of archers. This is fun. I'm actually sort of surprised that no over showed up here. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna do it. So many out of the windows! What? You, you charmed them too close. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking in a panic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's just <laughs> like a bowling ball hitting a keg or a pin whenever one of them dies. Yeah, I can hear a little bit. Okay, good. <laughs> Another endless level. What the? Ah, Haymaker. Spins and knocks around enemies, resets after firing. That was said to be effective against flying enemies. Of course, we get it after if they are introduced. <laughs> One last barricade upgrade. So now they are the cheapest that they can be. And only two skulls left. <laughs> Torture. Torture burns target long. 
burns them, so they do take higher damage. And but damage over time. Ow. We do, I think we thought they flames cover a larger arc, but that could be yet then useful. Yeah, then they can overlay. So now we can mostly narrow them down into one pass. Once we start getting some income. Alright, yeah, then I. The choice is yours, Seth. Yeah, let me go see here. Damage or arc. I think I do sort of do even more damage, at least for now. What? Monster kill? I get most kill, but do an upgrade? Okay. Let me do a quick little right. check here. Let's see. Monster. Get a 25 kill streak. Yeah. Okay, Precipice. If you can't get past the level, try playing Endless Mode to earn more, a few more skulls. Okay. We must go through the rift. Is this rift. You mean, back to the old Order fortresses? Until we discover the source, we are only reacting as each new rift opens. The answer lies in the dead world of the orcs. Wait a minute. How do I know this isn't some evil person suddenly turned sexy partner trip? Your growing powers are a match for mine. Are you afraid? I know I am, but what are you? Wait, that came out wrong. Uh, yeah, like I said in the original, the war mage is an idiot savant. Okay, let's... Wait, how many rifts are there now? Three! Uh, there are four. They're flying ones from which the flyers will start coming. Instead of just popping in through the broken roof. Alright, I guess the flashing marks on the meme map tells us that's where we spawn. Yeah, that's the active ones. Okay, so it means we will probably on this first round <laughs> face the damn flyers. Let's see. Actually, actually oh, that dear. doesn't help at all because they're going to come the other way. Yeah, I guess perhaps between these pillars. Yeah, first off, I'm going to see... Are they going to try and sneak past through this little bit? Yes, they are. Okay, now they're all going to cross over here, which makes them very vulnerable. Let's see, and we st I still have enough for one more. Which I should right, probably uh, put between here. I'll never notice this. But, uh, yeah, uh, point me, where do you want me to put traps? Uh, for now, go uh, over here. All uh, right. Preferably not past this point, because if any trap past here is going to hit less of the income, uh, the inflow of work, so to speak. Oh, wait, wait. You, you think the minecart may steal income? Uh, no. Uh, <clears throat> any kills by the minecarts will be attributed to us as well. It's just that any... This is where the other orbs will be coming in. If you put a trap that covers this area, it'll only catch like 50% of the orbs that'll come by. Oh, now I see what you mean. Uh, now we're uh, looking at the waste. Okay, I get it, I get it. Yeah. I get it. Okay. Yeah, we need to choke those choke points hard. And actually, I, I should have checked out my you know, spell book before I started placing these. Because now it's too late anyways. Oh, I forgot to check myself. Whoops. Yeah, we'll be dealing with flyers here as well. And that haymaker would have been the first of the ceiling traps. But of course, we'd be able to play on the ceiling everywhere. And yeah, we can just shoot them down. But this would do for now. I hope. My idea is to put, uh, to block off this path as well. And yeah, we, we forgot to check for the enemies. So we don't know if there will be sappers coming in. Oh uh, well, I guess, I guess that, makes it, <laughs> that makes it more interesting. Uh, look up. Yeah, we have a bunch of bold issues. And magma carts. 
so we do have plenty of backup traps, luckily enough, and there comes the tires. The very least, they're slow as molasses. Wait. How big gloss reuse does the show spell have? I thought I missed there. I shouldn't stand too close to the barricades, otherwise they <laughs> <laughs> uh, It's raining orcs. Whoa, <laughs> uh. Oh, 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 crap, crap, I missed flyers. It even took the cobalt and... Oh no, you don't get out of blast hole. That was fun! Okay, now the other side is opening up. There's a trap here. No, no, the trap blocking it off here. Yeah, they all got one ended, I agree. Okay, this, these are less hindered by the minecarts, so they still are somewhat. And, okay, we can run through these for little shortcuts. Ooh! Is that a liver? Bastard to shoot the other orcs. Yep. That's handy. Especially since they can't attack back. Oh, sneaky bastards. Yeah, there's so many times I just have to quickly turn around to shoot the one that's trying to run past me. Luckily, they are uh, weak as hell. Oh. Yeah, they, they spawned a few flyers from the other side. We're trying to sneak past because we were busy here. Ugh, I'm gonna barf! Okay. You know, this is nothing. There, there's little funnier than seeing Quark's cart wheeling through the air. Actually, it's, it's pretty useful if you charm the ones that are on the side near the railing. Just yeah, yeah. drop a bomb on them and knock a bunch of them over. Ooh. Crossing over. Why? Are they gonna re realize that uh, that's a bad idea? Yeah. <laughs> that's a problem that solves itself. I don't even go to shoot unless they get past that, which seems to be unlikely. <laughs> Out of the frying pan into my fire. Okay, some at least. Like a block didn't of have to shoot. Yep, they can't block. Yep, last one. That makes a block. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now this pass is done. And now they'll start coming from every side. None shall pass! Oh dear. And that was a very obvious Gandal reference. Uh, wait, there was? I, I didn't hear that. What did he say? None shall pass. But well, that's true. So there's no real need to waste time with them at the moment.
Right, if, if you charm them, if you're charmed one that's on the middle of the pass, then it will cause a bunch of them to pass and get hit. Yeah, that, that's what I'm trying to do. More fun if you kill them all in one. Flyers, yeah. Oh. Ogre warning. Yeah, I know what I can do. Beat the ogres. Baba. Ah, there's one. I live for mass or I think, I think just with these four barricades, I, I take care of like a third of the orcs coming across. A third of the orcs total, because they come, they run across there and get knocked out, knocked, knocked over the edge. Yeah, and it seems that the ogres have also spun from the blast and Lunk, he says. Okay, uh, we can redesign a bit. Welcome to Mike. I have enough uh, money to block this path up mostly as well. Or to force them through a, a gauntlet. Let's see, I have enough for... Oh, I just seven. had an evil idea. <laughs> oh, oh, damn it. Yeah. And that cost us some points. But did you die? Picnic time! Yep. This forces them all to go across the area. And okay, the, the combat music started early. Okay, this looks like a scary trap, doesn't it? <laughs> so we should probably have some uh, further back uh, as a backup. So I should probably start preparing traps further in, in case they start to uh, somehow get through. Yeah, at the next build phase, yeah, we should still get a build phase, yeah. Uh, uh, yes. we, you, you could remove most of these, then I can build up a short path for them to be focused on. Okay. Already double ogres from both sides. I somehow shot both ogres with one spell. Yeah, I, we're going to need to choke. We're going to need to leave them down the path. Oh, and we've got fire. Online. Points from them, and, and some of them got through. Yeah, some of the flyers. Oh. Uh, yeah, we're going to need to focus them through one single line here. Yeah, so more touch inside here, basically. Ow, 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 ow. Uh, yeah, this is obvious. Obvious the ogre's max stun. At least it doesn't reapply on every hit. Otherwise, uh, yeah, they could completely stun the ogre. Best one they ever! Time to make some more traps in your life. Also, did the sorceress just say, I, this one hurts, I tried Let's it myself? Go. I did not hear it, she said uh, something else for me. Check out her acid little sprinklers. Already. 
And it doesn't stun the oak, but it does make him flinch. I think it might be better to remove this one and put wall blades here. But that's too late. Time now. to go to work. Waste the time as much as possible. That was probably a bad place. That's going to get attacked. Still hit them from this distance. <laughs> ah, and we got him. We got ogres. Yep, we do. Now that's a sticky situation. <laughs> oh, oh crap! They're slipping through with one. That's a lot of. That's a lot of bags wasted. Point wasted. A flyer, flyer. They're almost there. A flyer stuck through on the other side. It's more fun when you kill them all at once. Yeah, we should have <laughs> we should have gotten the haymakers and the flyers. Okay, time to redesign from here on. Tell that so you can put a wall bag laid over there. I, this can also use a bit of rework. It's too spread out at the moment. We need to focus them down more. All this? Yeah. Oh. We worked so well at start. Uh, yeah, I'm thinking I can put down some barricades to keep them on the on the rails longer. And then have them go like this here. Alright, in the meantime, sell all this so we can put out the barricade. I'll just leave this right here. See? This. Okay, this forces them down over the rails the longest. We'll, we'll need more damaging traps than ju than the ice ones to deal with the ogres. Don't worry, I am planning, I am planning, I just was preparing so they we need the real damage makers. This flimsy waste high wooden barricade will stop them. Okay. Put 
put some bowl blades over here. York stops here. Okay, can you can you remove this uh, ice vent here? This one? Uh, the one in the middle. Okay. And that's the last stretch. And that's <laughs> all nearly all of my coin gone. I still have plenty. So let's remove that one, put it here. This will keep them going for quite a while. But don't forget damage traps. I am. I'm putting uh, some fire traps around here, around here and there, everywhere. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. But even then, uh, they need some uh, help. Oh, I've got to make you an idea. have to call it after this uh, level though. Already that much? Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, let's see. There's still room on the walls for spread ears. Especially yeah. here. Look at that. Let's see. I, I think you want to put those at the front more. Just I have like, oh wait, that was last Work from the front to the back. <laughs> because this this place is a bit barren of uh, floor traps. You can get one, two, three, four, five here. Uh, that was last time I cut coins. Yeah, you can you can remove a bunch of these over here. Yeah, actually, actually past this point, I don't think we should put more trap because, uh, yeah, by this point they should be dead. They're all, they're already going to be stuck here for like full minutes. And it's best to front load the traps at the front, not the back. Yeah, uh, yeah, you have to spend a little bit too much on uh, just in case. Okay. Yeah, these ones are not needed here. The, the ice vents are useful, but only in keeping targets in front of the traps. That's it. He should be good. This one here is. This one here isn't helping anything. Let the cold take. Them. down more sprayers over here. Let's double dose them. It's the it's the ogres that we need this damage for. Yeah, yes, look, look over the coin and yeah, I don't have any much don't have any more coin now. Okay. May this help. Okay, the rest of my coins will be going to wall blades then. Let's roll! Fires in the air! Flyers. Actually we could put I could put up some arrow traps for the flyers. That's 
a lot of dead orcs. Ooh, here's a good one. Uh, more flyers. Those sneaky bastards are the most annoying ones. Since we're a bit busy with the ground troops. Yeah, and it seems like I am very effective against the flyer sense. They don't take much time to die, and I'm shooting like a machine gun. I might be able to put another. No, that, that room is too little. It's too little room for the wording. I can hear ogres coming. Yep. It's just a green think. rainbow of corpses. <laughs> Why are you taking so many shots? I'll be definitely gonna get hits. Our flyers. Last one. This will slow them down even more. Sometimes I almost feel bad for the orcs. Except, not really. Let's roll. Nice. In the air. Uh, yeah, any more points for me are going to get the traps on the wall, upper walls. Uh, no. Tons of money. I can afford to be wasteful. Okay. And you can see what's happening here. Uh, oh wait, yeah, I have some that could, should not have freaked out. Uh, yeah. Careful, the archers will work the barricades. Fires! Flyers, flyers. Already dealing with them. Okay, over is from the first bend. Who's your mommy? Okay, knees down. That's the last of them. Let's put you down there right now. Oh, it, it'd be so fitting if these first things were getting killed with the cards. How they sound like bowling pins. It seems like when the cards run right into them, the cards actually break. Against greedy, and that's that. Halfway there? Achievement? Wait, are we only halfway through the game? I hope not. And we got the ceiling trap, 
Shoot to drop boulders on enemies. Type is a ceiling trap. <laughs> okay, let's have a little look. I don't think we'll be able to. Oh, well, yeah, that's the freaking crossbow from the original. Oh, I think you'll like this in the, among the weapons for a 13 dwarven hammer. I I have more of a missile launcher. Uh, oh, yeah, that the, makes sense. The, the war mage is the melee character. Or the more melee focused. Yeah, I have a crossbow. I have my satchel. Okay, so still a bit more divergence between the characters. I have also the ring of lightning and wing belt. So I can't afford them at the moment. I keep pressing this one over here. And this. I can't believe the blade stop. Uh, yeah. You probably don't want to really because you are more for distance. Yeah. Let's see. Oh. All enemies have a chance to drop coins. Drop attack. Drop attack. Drop bomb top and cause targets to bleed briefly. Haymaker. And wolf melee attack sometimes knock back foes. Okay. Okay, I upgraded the haymaker. That should help deal with flying enemies. So, yeah, we didn't actually use it, so we didn't actually see if that would instant kill them, but yeah. Better to be sure than uh, having some freaking bats fly past. Yeah. And the, the thing, what should I upgrade here next? I, I guess the upgrades I have uh, so the fire burns longer on enemies. Okay, let's. Yeah, once you're done, let's head back to the campaign menu. There we go. So, what should I click? Uh, campaign menu. The second uh, lowest. I have spellbook ready, start the party. Ready, maybe then? Okay, that, that, that. Oh, that worked. Okay. And, yeah, th that's been a. Okay, we're at 2 hours 21 minutes. Yeah. Over time? Yeah, these, these streams will probably go a bit longer because, yeah, instantly you could see these missions go on for longer than the originals and let's see how many levels let's... okay so we are up to about half okay that was half of the levels okay hmm. two four six eight those make sense but in turn they're all harder yeah Okay, maybe we will look at some other stuff here. Uh, though, that, hmm. would you be willing to buy some of these DLCs to continue this on a bit longer, perhaps? Actually, um, hmm. when we do it for the story, so it feels a bit uh, unnecessary. Okay, here's an idea then. For the, we do the story with the, with this stream. But then the other stuff we could add on to, uh, yeah, something someday buffer in case all of the games end up sucking. Uh, yes. Okay. For now, though, yeah, <laughs> this was a ton of fun, especially here with the, uh, the last one. Yeah. <laughs> it got dicey partway through at points. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, th this game is a ton of fun, and you know, everything is more fun in Crow Up. Oh yeah. So, yeah, chat has been silent, so I'm presuming it's mostly bots in there. Uh, well, actually, I should take a look at this, because I found a site that has been identifying that, and yeah, these all smell like bots to me. I recognize two of them from a, a list of known bots. 
and the third one is probably as well. So, yeah, I guess we go straight to you then. Thank you for, <laughs> for playing along, Drakir. Oh, you're most welcome. And, yeah, to anyone else who maybe uh, may ha have been watching now anyways and just didn't get listed, thank you as well. And, yeah, two days more of this and I don't really, I don't hope that we'll finish the game in that. Uh, I hope to at least get another two streams out of this. Yeah, yeah. same. The missions will probably get longer with each one. Um, yeah, and likely harder as well. <laughs> yeah. So For, it, it was, the first were few qu missions were the short ones. Yep. And yeah, this, the wave counts are going to go up and up and up. <clears throat> and actually, let's have a little look in the spell book here under Vanity. Okay. <laughs> Glad Knight of the Order, Orc Skin. <laughs> you will be the life of any ogre party in this alluring Orc Skin. Uh, okay, that looks pretty nice. I, hmm. now, I don't think I'll grind uh, skulls off screen just for a cosmetic thing. So, for now though, yeah. Next time, more Orcs Must Die 2 with two players. But until then, until then. Be safe, folks! And, oh, come on, the stupid macros are malfunctioning again. Even, oh, actually. It's, it, this is a silly little thing. They met. The macro keys I have on the side, yeah, they only seem to work, or want to work, when I have OBS selected, like this.